Hi, this is Craig from Wood Magazine, and I want to show you a quick no math method for laying out a circle into eight equal parts using just the compass that you use to draw the circle. So let's start by drawing that circle. I've just set the compass for an arbitrary measurement here. My center point for my circle, point goes there, and we'll just draw the circle. I'm going to press down here a little bit so you can see it better on the video. Get a dark line. So there's a circle. First step is to simply draw a diameter across that circle. Put a ruler there, pencil in the center point, and then there's my diameter. Now the trick is just to expand the compass a little bit. Actually, the more the better, uh, but you don't have to go overboard on this. And then take the compass, put the point at the intersection of your diameter and the circle, and then just draw an arc on both sides, then come down here to this point, do the same thing, and those two lines will intersect. Going back to the ruler, I'm gonna set that again in the center point and align it with those two intersections and draw a line across the circle again. Now the circle is divided into four parts. To get to the 8, we're going to divide our quarters. So we just set the compass again for just an arbitrary measurement, about half the distance between these two points. So just, you know, not even have to be close. So there's that measurement. We're going to make an arc here, an arc down here. Make these fairly long because you want to be able to intersect them. Then we're going to work our way around the circle. doing the same thing. You'll see I'm ending up with an intersection. Then we we'll missed that one just a little bit, so we'll extend that line. So there are my four intersecting points. Doing the same thing with the ruler, aligning it with the center point, and then those opposite intersections. I can draw a line through there. And a line through those two intersections. And there's a circle divided into eight equal parts. Now, if you want to avoid drawing lines all the way across, if you just need to mark the circumference of your circle, of course, you can go ahead and do that instead of drawing the lines all the way across and needing to erase those.